Okay, so in this video I will be showing you guys how to find float value of every single item in the Steam Market. So the first thing you need to do is get this program called, just search it, CSGO float value. Um, so this program, think of my install. What you need to do is have this program. Um, you also need CSGO float and market float checker extension on Google Chrome. So, and you must also sign into um, no matter what you skin. CSGO, CSGO zone. So, you need to sign in. CSGOZone.net, which I already did, and um, so that's basically it. You, add, you install this program, which you can find a link here depending on what version of Windows you're using. You sign into CSGOZone.net, you get Steam Market Flow Checker extension, it's really helpful. And now you're gonna find a skin you like. So let's go to Steam Community. I don't have much. Okay. Go to market. You must do it through a web browser. Okay. So catch right global Okay. Um, let's say I want to find lowest float for off Asimov. I'm gonna find so as you can see the lowest it's a battle scarred version. Um, let's go. So you see, um, there's 383 op Asimov right here. And if we check float by clicking this button, we have to do it 383 times. That's why we have this wonderful program. You run it. Okay, um, you just log in. Okay, um, and you enter your code, the Steam card code. I don't mind. This account has nothing to hack because there's literally nothing on this account. Okay, once you've done it, you need to copy the address on top. Here, paste. Now you want this this field here will uh, check how many items you like to search. Well, by default you can. Um, it says 100, but it actually goes up to 3,000. Two or 3,000, but I usually search for uh, 1,000 because that's so because there yeah, are 383. You can you can just type. 383 right here, but and I'm using Canadian dollars. You click retrieve item. Okay, it takes some. Okay, some skin might have got time delay. Just leave it as default. Increasing it will be better, but it will take more time to process. And then you hit start. So now it starts processing. As you can see, you can already see the float value being shown. Okay, I might have to reload the page so that it correctly. Now you can sort out for the highest float or lowest float for the current skin. So at position 11, we have the float value of 0 0.91. So this is the first position, second, and finally this is at position number 10. So position number 11 should be on the second page, this one. You need to 
make sure that it is a float we're looking for. You also need to check the price. 31, 33. Yes, that's correct. Now, for some skin, the price might be absolutely the same. So you still have to check float. Just click this button. There you go. If you still do not believe it's the correct float, you can continue uh, copy this link address and you go to csgozone.net steam market paste it still not sure if it's the correct flow sign in through steam sign in item flow you paste it just wait a moment wait Still waiting. Okay. Cisco.exchange usually takes a lot of time, I don't know why. Okay, so as you can see, 9152. We are absolutely sure. And if you're not convinced by the number, you can go CSGO screenshots. This is a really great website. It allows us to find to see the screenshot of the current weapon while it's inspecting without having to um, open the game. So as you can see, the program still runs. It allows me to find the lowest float out here because I'm searching for battles card, so the float value only goes. 0.45 okay well are we convinced not really super black but still because this is not a fast flow ever so that's how you do it and when you're happy you can always click buy now yep that's it thank you for watching i hope you enjoy my video have fun